Joachim Rodriguez Oliver, born the 12th of May 1979, is a former Spanish professional road racing cyclist. His notable results in Grand Tours include 14 stage victories, second place overall in the 2012 Giro d'Italia, finishing second overall in the 2015 Vuelta a España, third place in the general classification of the Vuelta a España in both 2010 and 2012 and third place in the 2013 Tour de France. He also finished first of the UCI World Rankings in 2010, 2012 and 2013, and won classics such as the Flesh Wallon and the Giro di Lombardia twice. He also won stage races including the Volta a Catalunya twice, the 2015 Tour of the Basque Country and the 2011 Vuelta a Burgos. Personal Life and Early Career Rodriguez was born in Barcelona, the son of an amateur rider in the 1960s, and later lived in Parrots del Vales. Some years later he moved to the Basque Country to ride for Iberdrola, an amateur team associated with the professional cycling team once, Iraski. His nickname in the professional peloton is Purito, Spanish for Little Cigar a name he was given in an early season training camp during his first year as a professional with once Iraski, when some of his teammates stepped up the pace on a small climb. He passed them making a hand gesture appearing to be smoking a cigar, suggesting he was climbing without much effort. The gesture was not welcomed by his teammates, who made him smoke a real cigar as a hazing ritual later in the evening professional career. Once. In 2001 he turned professional with Once. Iraski after riding for the team in late 2000 as a stage year. In 2001, during his first season as a professional, he won the Escalada Amangic, a race held in Barcelona, while he also won team time trials with Once. Iraski at the Volta at Catalunya and Vuelta a España. Sanier Duval Proter. In 2004, he joined Sanier Duval Proter and won the Set Mona Catalana de Ciclisme, a stage race held in Catalonia. The following year, he won Subida Arqueola in the mountains classification of the Vuelta a España, while he finished second in the CL, Cicca de San Sebasti, and in the Vuelta a Burgos. Castaparn. After joining Kestaparn, Isles Balliers in 2006, he won the fifth stage of the Paris. Nice. In 2007 he became the Spanish road race champion and also won the Classic of Primavera in Pruela, Villafranca de Ordizia. In 2008 he won a stage to Monte Lupone at the third stage of Tirreno. Adriatico atop a 1.7 km climb with sections over 20% in gradients which had many cyclists coming in after him. Get off and run while carrying their bikes or zigzag up the climb since it was so steep. But he was one of the few who powered up the difficulty while riding a straight line. Katusha In 2010 he joined the Russian team Team Katusha which guaranteed him a position at the Tour de France and a leading role in certain races throughout the season. 2011 In 2011 he won a stage at the Vuelta al Pais Vasco and finished second behind Philippe Gilbert at both the Amstel Gold Race and La Fleche Wallonne. He later finished fifth at the Giro d'Italia and won the stages to La Colle d. Olivard and Le Dessure in the Criterium du Dauphiné, where he won the points and mountains classifications and finished fifth overall. He skipped the Tour de France to concentrate on the races at the end of the season, mainly the Vuelta a España, where he was considered a possible candidate for winning the race. He ended the season with a third place at the Giro di Lombardia. 2012 on 18 April 2012, he won La Flèche Wallonne in Belgium with a superb climb on the Mer de Hoy and finished second in the Tour of the Basque Country. 
Rodriguez took his good form into the Giro d'Italia where he won two stages and finished second. Overall to Canadian rider Hess Jittle. He was always competitive with a general classification contenders in the high mountains and held the Maglia Rosa coming into the final individual time trial, where he lost 47 seconds to Hess Jittle, therefore losing the overall lead by 16 seconds. However, he won the points classification jersey, with a slim lead of one point over Mark Cavendish. On the Vuelta a España, Rodriguez almost took the win on stage 3, but Alejandro Valverde popped up on his right to steal the victory in a photo finish, and snatched the red jersey. Rodriguez went in Italy to compete in the Giro di Lombardia, where he had the opportunity to take the first place in the 2012 UCI World Tour detained by Bradley Wiggins. He did exactly that by winning the race under heavy rain and temperatures oscillating around 10. C. He attacked on the final difficulty of the day, the Villa Vergano climb. He arrived at the top of the difficulty alone and descended to Leco, claiming the victory with a gap of 9 seconds. 2013 In 2013, Rodriguez started his season winning Stage 4 in the Tour of Oman, where he ended up finishing 4th overall. He later won Stage 5 of the Tirreno. Adriatico and went on to finish 5th overall. After following an attack from Peter Sagan and Vincenzo Nibali on stage 6 and gaining time on his rivals, Rodriguez rode the Volta at Catalonia and Liege, Basto, Liege, where at both races he finished 2nd behind Dan Martin. Rodriguez later aimed for a high finish in the Tour de France. In the Tour, Rodriguez had a quiet start and after the first time trial on stage 11, Rodriguez was 11th overall, over 5 minutes behind the race leader. Rodriguez picked up his form on stage 15 in which he finished 4th on Mont Ventoux, moving him into the top 10. He later finished 3rd on the uphill time trial stage. On stage 18, he moved into the top 5 after finishing 5th on Alp d'Huez, gaining a minute on race leader Chris Froome. On the mountainous stage 20 to Annecy Semnos, he finished 2nd behind Nairo Quintana. However, Rodriguez managed to move into a podium position in the final general classification after gaining over a minute over Alberto Contador and Roman Cruziger. After the Tour de France, he took a long break and then came as the leader of Katusha's at the start of the 2013 Vuelta a España, a race he twice finished on the podium in the past. One of the favorites at the start of the race, Rodriguez won the 19th stage and finished fourth in the overall classification, more than three minutes behind winner Chris Horner. 2014 Rodriguez's first race of the season was the Tour de San Luis, where he finished 71st, without making an impact in the mountains. After this, Rodriguez went to the Dubai Tour and the Tour of Oman, where he eventually finished 4th, behind Chris Froome, Tajay Van Garderen, and Rigoberto Ur. N. 2015 Rodriguez started his season somewhat late and quietly by taking the 13th place overall in Tirreno, Adriatico. He mounted on the third step of the podium twice in stages of that race. He had his first win of the season on a mountainous third stage of the Tour of the Basque Country, outsprinting Nairo Quintana and Sergio Henao after a descent in Zumarraga. In the Tour de France, Rodriguez won the third stage finishing atop the Mer de Hoy. The Mer de Hoy is something that I know extremely well. I, they seen it before, said the Spaniard in reference to the difficulty being featured every year in the race La Fleche, Wallone. 2016 Rodriguez struggled in the early part of the season, partly due to illness. After the tour, he headed to the CL, Sica de San Sebasti, N, where he finished fourth and was awarded the prize for most aggressive rider. After the race he told the media that the CL, Sica was his final competition in Spain, 
ruling out participation in the Vuelta a España. Whilst Katusha director sport of Xavier Florencio described Rodriguez's ride in San Sebastián as being his last for the team. Career achievements Major results Grand Tour General Classification Results Timeline World Road Championships Results Timeline